Sebastian's Nick McGurk is live and fills us in with a few tips. Nick. Hi, Alana. Drive Right Driving School here in Midvale. We came here to get tips on what to do in snow and, God forbid, black ice. You can see the ice here on the road. We've got Rick Antone here, and, you know, he's going to show us just exactly what it looks like to go ahead and spin out on the roads. This is live television, folks. Don't try this at home. And this is just how dramatic it can look. Imagine what troopers had to look at yesterday with some 350 crashes in some 24 hours. Take a listen. What looked like just a sheen of uh, moisture on top of the road surface was actually ice. Uh, people still wanted to go 70 miles an hour, which they feel is the posted speed limit, and they have a right to go, but they don't. Uh, when the weather, when the roadway gets wet, we need you to slow down significantly. Slow down. Give plenty of space. You've heard those before. Rick Antone's about to get out of the car. We have a couple of questions for him. And the big question I have for him as a driving instructor and, and a professional former driver is, Rick, when you start to hit a turn, obviously that was quite dramatic, but let's say you start to fishtail left. What do you do? Well, you want to stay calm and relaxed. Uh, and you want to uh, keep driving the car. Don't ever give up, okay? The car's either going to completely spin or it's going to stop. From, from there, what you want to do is stay but, calm again. But and you, you talked about turning into the... So if I'm going left, are you turning left as well? Yes, you're so turning the wheel a little you're bit. You're always turning into the direction that you're sliding. So if the car's sliding right, turn right. If the car's sliding left, turn left. And you're letting your foot off the gas. You're staying calm. You're never yes. giving up. Yes. You, and, and what you want to do is, after the, after the spin or after the turn, what you want to do is, you want to get out of the way. If you're on the highway, you're on a road, you want to get out of the lane of travel so that you don't end up causing another uh, accident. That's amazing advice. Get out of the way. Of course, a lot of folks want to know what to do before that happens, but once that happens, do get out of the way safely. More tips coming up at 6 o'clock. Rick, thank you so much. We'll send it back to you in the studio. All right. Thank